Let's take a look at the Atlantis tank by Aspire. Take it out of the box and turn it upside down. Then you unscrew the base from the tank and you'll immediately notice the atomizer. This cylinder is filled with cotton and a coil. It absorbs the liquid inside the tank, it heats up the coil, and it creates the vapor. Because this Atlantis tank is brand new, the atomizer is dry. So hitting it would taste like burnt cotton. So we want to make sure we prime it with a few drops of liquid first. Set the base aside, and now let's fill the tank. You want to fill it to just below the top of the metal stem inside the tank. Just place the eyedropper between the metal stem and the glass and keep adding drops until it's full. And you really don't want to get e-liquid down the stem, otherwise you may end up getting a taste of it when you take a drag. Screw the cap back on the bottle of juice and we're ready to put it all together. Keeping the tank upside down, just align the atomizer with the metal stem inside the tank and then slowly tighten it back down. Once it's tightened down, you're good to go. You'll notice the collar on the bottom of the tank has holes for adjustable airflow. You can twist it to find the airflow setting you like. The larger holes will create more vapor and the smaller settings will create less. Now just tighten the tank onto your device and you're ready to start vaping.